Welcome back. Good morning. How's everyone doing? This is Justin from Bagel Talk. I've gone outside my normal Long Island area. I am up here in Westchester. I got a golf game later this afternoon, so I've been running around trying to get as many spots up here in Westchester because we know all the Bagel Talk fans are asking us to get up here. We know Doe. We want to see if these guys know Doe. I am in the Port Chester on 211 Irving Avenue. Uh, this is the Bagel Emporium. There seems to be a couple of Bagel Emporiums up in the Westchester area. We want to see if these guys know Doe. Happens to be a great looking spot. Uh, they got some nice uh, tables outside. People enjoying their bagels out there. Beautiful day. Um, big branding on this place. It says the best bagel in Westchester Magazine. Well, I appreciate Westchester Magazine, but if I'm gonna go for the best, I want the best bagel around, period. I mean, when's the Bagel Talk number one review? I'll throw it out there what the bests are. I'll give them my top 10 soon, but I wanna get the entire area. So these guys are saying Westchester Magazine, saying it's the best. Well, I know, don't wanna see if these guys know, though. Went in, it was a good line, people working very hard in there. All right, it's like just, just around nine o'clock in the morning. This bagel's not hot, which we all do appreciate, so that means constant baking. Um, but it's a good looking bagel. Good color, good texture, definitely a round bagel. We'll check the Harvey Hole test. I think spins no problem. We kind of like that as we know. Um, again, not warm. It's not really a crispy bagel. I'll break it open. Um, a little bit of crumb. I'm gonna take a bite of this first one, see how it tastes. See, a bagel talk. Everyone's gonna have different opinions. Magazine's gonna tell you who's the best and who's not. I'm just here because I'm passionate about dough. And I want to tell you where I think you should go. It's a nice bagel. It's a good bite. Are my reviews always going to be perfect? Well, the review might be perfect. My rating might not be perfect. But that's what the talk, the TAWK is about. We want you getting talking about bagels. You know I won't stop talking. So I'm out here trying this. That's a good bite. It'd be nice if it's warm and it's tough to get them all at the end of the day. You know, everyone on the same playing field. Um, these guys are working hard in there. I also asked them for an everything bagel, toasted cream cheese. I want to check out the seed ratio, see what they do, see how they toast, see how they package. Got a nice little diaper right here on this on, on this one. Open this guy up, see what we got going on. We got seed coverage on both sides. Looks really good. Got a nice cream cheese to bagel ratio. This looks like it's going to be a good bite, actually, this one. Let me take a bite. It's a good bite. Well done. A little pigeon dropping's coming. You know, again, everyone's gonna have their favorite bagel. But when I go out, I try six, seven bagels in the morning. So I have something to compare to. I've been all over. I've been to New York. I've been to LA. I've been to Miami. I've been to Chicago. I'm checking bagels all over. Cause at Bagel Talk, we know dough. We wanna see if these guys know dough. On a scale of one to 10, I like this bagel, it's serviceable. Is it gonna make my best of list? Probably not, but up here in Westchester, Westchester Magazine saying this is the number one, eight years running. On a scale of one to 10, I'm gonna give this bagel a 6.8. It's serviceable, it's solid. Am I getting off the road to run to Big Emporium? Probably not, but if I live in town, I'm gonna be pretty happy. Place is great, they're doing good things. Come and check them out. This is Justin from Bagel Talk. Share with your friends, comment, tell us what you think. We know dough, these guys, they kinda know dough.